In this video, we're going to combine functions using algebraic operations. And the operation we're going to use here is we're going to divide the f function and the g function. And then we're going to input a half. Before we do this, though, I like to kind of do the general version, which would be without this one half input for x. So I'm going to write this as f divided by g of x, the general version, without any number plugged in, which is equal to f of x divided by g of x. And then I can just plug in each equation. So I have f of x, which is 8x squared plus 4x minus 1 divided by 6x plus 3, which is a g of x function. So this is the general equation for f divided by g of x. Now they want me to input a, input a half, so what I'm going to write is now f of g with an input of a half is going to equal 8 times 1 half squared plus 4 times 1 half minus 1. And I'm going to divide it by 6 times 1 half and then I'm going to add 3. So all I've done is plugged in the 1 half for x in the equation. And I could do this for any number because I have the general equation, which is why I wrote it to begin with. Let's go ahead and take 1 half squared. That's a fourth. So we have 8 times 1 fourth plus 4 times 1 half minus 1 over, we take 6 times a half, we get 3, plus 3 on the bottom. I'm going to slide this up a little bit. And we have 8 times a fourth, which is 2, plus 4 times a half, which is 2, minus 1, over 3, plus 3. 2 plus 2 minus 1 is going to be 3 over 6, which reduces to 1 half. So if you plug 1 half into the function for f divided by g, you actually end up with 1 half for your solution. 